Whatever you are, whatever you're planning, I'm gonna stop you. No, you aren't. You're gonna join me. What? Think about it, Clark. My intellect, your powers. Together we could rule this world. We'll walk as gods among men. You're not a god, I'm not even sure you're human. Are you? Is the real Lex still alive? Oh, you don't get it, do you? I am the real Lex! Is he still alive? Sort of. I mean, I couldn't really be sure what would happen to me if I killed him, so... I tucked him away where I can keep an eye on him. Maybe torture him a little when I'm feeling blue. Where is he? Where is he? What's the matter, Clark? You look a little sick. Just like back in the lab when you were with the other me. When he opened the safe door and exposed you to the meteor rock. Every man has a weakness, Clark. No matter how superhuman he may be. I've embraced my destiny. Now embrace yours. We can forge a new future together. I'll never join you. Yes, you will. Or everyone you love will suffer! I'm guessing that doesn't happen very often. Lex! What did you do? I gotta hand it to you guys. I mean, keeping something like this a secret must have required an impressive ability to obscure the truth. Maybe the Kents and the Luthers have something in common after all. Yeah! I know about the Green Meteor Rock and Clark's unique gifts. What do you want? The world, Mrs. Kent. And your son's gonna help me bring it to its knees. Now talk some sense into him before something unfortunate happens. <laughs> like that. Dad! You were right about me all along, Mr. Kent. I am the villain of the story.